San Salvador is a, a selling point for students because, well, you're on San Salvador. It's a remote, unique experience. You have wonderful beaches that you won't see a soul all day. You can snorkel in clear, pristine water and you get to see really, really cool carbonate geology. The best geologist is the one who's seen the most rocks. And I think that trips like this like really make that happen. We learned a lot about this stuff in the classroom, but until you really have a hands-on experience, you don't really have a full picture. A trip like San Salvador is really just kind of one piece of that bigger puzzle of professors who really care about our particular education. They really care that we get to see the rocks, we get outside, we get to look at what we're dealing with. You know, we approach it with books, we approach it with hand samples in the lab, but like being here where there are rocks being made right now is, is a transformative experience. But to understand ancient rocks, it's best to have uh, viewed something to do with the modern. I think it's important that all students have some modern environment ground truthing and San Salvador's ground truthing for what we study in the Permian Basin. All this stuff that we're sitting on is basically still alive today and this is what we're swimming over. It's really neat to be able to walk on this, map it out, and kind of compare this to what's out there. I think it just really like broadens your horizons as a geologist. Being able to see it live and dead, it really helps you contextualize any time that you go to an outcrop and you're looking at rocks, you can now reflect back to like seeing these processes. When I'm in a laboratory, when I'm at a computer, when I'm doing research, I can remember those experiences and be a much better researcher and apply that to my work and it's really incredible. Every day I've seen new things and I think that that, like it's such a small island, but seriously, every day new things, new animals, new rock formations, new ways of thinking about what I'm seeing. I think most geology students like to be out looking at rocks. Besides being out in the field, for most geologists it's just plain fun, you know, and they take those memories with them.